Welcome to a day in the life of a chartered accountant trainee. To be honest with you guys, October and November has brought so much joy and so much disappointment, but I'm learning to put my hope in the Lord as he loves me. Good morning, real ones. Welcome to another vlog. It is currently 5 a.m. in the morning and I know I'm like uh, uh, quite vibrant, but I usually uh, watch things that are very uh, vibrant, trying to stay off my phone. Um, I feel like I've been touching my phone a lot these days. I'm going to just go and do a bit of quiet time, uh, watch a sermon, go through my affirmations, um, listen to something positive, but usually in the car. In the car, I usually listen to Montel B, um, who speaks a, a lot about like um, basically self-development and just making sure that you're the best person possible. So I listen to that in the car and then right now I'm just going to listen or watch a sermon from Transformation Church and the one that I'm watching is called Cuff to Control. So yeah and then also guys um, I got featured on the Accounting South African uh, November issue. Please do check it out. So it's shower time. I'm putting my towel on the hook. I'm ready to shower, guys. There's actually this new uh, body wash that I use that smells absolutely amazing. Also, to be honest with you guys, I use this time to think of 10 things that I'm grateful for. Although I'm not consistent with it, but it helps me to start my day on a great note. So I'm also going to use this time to exfoliate my body, which I do at least two times in a week. And I'm currently using Dove uh, Sensitive Soap for my face. Um, as it just, it, it really takes care of my skin really well. So guys, um, this is just a bit of a snack for the day when I get to the office so that I'm not like hungry the whole time. Then I'm going to put my future life breakfast in here so that I am able to at least have breakfast when I get to work. Because like, honey, there is no time to do all of that. So I'm going to do that now. So yeah, this is the future life. Future life sponsor a girl honey i am guys i love future life so yeah so we're just going to put this in here so that when we get to the office we're able to you know have some proper breaky i think that should suffice actually a lot like i know you're looking at it and you're thinking ah but really it is a lot so this is my morning this is when i get to the office my future life there's milk at the office and then this is my snack, my 10 o'clock snack. And then I have my lunch. And then I also have pretzels inside my bag. I'll show you now. The lemon, yes, there's lemon. The lemon is for my water. I have to just squish it in there. But yeah. So I'm now currently on my way to the office. And for those of you who stay in Joburg, you guys know that traffic is a thing, unfortunately. But I use this time to listen to a good podcast, probably from To My Sisters or Wisdom and Wellness by Mbumila Dwaba. If any of you guys have great podcast suggestions, please comment down below. Hello. Hello. So guys, this is the outfit for the day. Please guys, I got new spectacles. Yay! Hey guys, welcome to a vlog. Hey guys, welcome to a come with me to the client come with me to the office vlog so today you guys are just gonna come and see what i do on a daily basis and yeah hey guys so it is currently 7 45 in the morning and i am gonna go upstairs to the client and so basically we are auditing um, a firm, a specific firm, an incorporation if I can say, I don't want to say too much. And we are going to be here for two months because it's a big audit, uh, it's a big client, a big client. So I wish I could take you guys with me but I can't because it's confidential but 
um, it's quite fun but just journey with me it's gonna be a good vlog great content it's the people like I feel like it's different like as people say like in LA so like I get so awkward with people watching it's not the camera that I'm scared of because I can speak and do whatever but it's like if people are passing I feel like oh my word like I'm that girl I don't want to be like I don't know like it's weird all eyes on you and it's like they probably think I'm this girl thinking but at the same time it's like I am like I genuinely want to share this content with you guys because I know you guys will enjoy it but yeah guys give it a thumbs up give it a like comment so i usually start my day with writing down the tasks that i need to do so that i don't forget this is actually the working space that me and my order team are going to be seated at um as they actually don't have boardrooms for us we usually are seated in like a boardroom area but this time my team and i are seated in uh that uh specific section and now i'm actually doing a bit of work but the team isn't there and i don't think i would feel comfortable filming with them there but anyway guys i am off to lunch now um yeah yeah so guys we are going down on a camel's back so guys it's lunchtime it is one and i've got some chow so i'm eating now and yeah okay guys like i'm feeling a bit like tired and a bit like not like sleepy but just like tired like i want the day to end um because like in terms of the work that we're supposed to do they haven't really like uh, uh necessarily planned the certain uh, execution tasks that we need to do as yet so i've just been focused on helping others and uh, catching up on work that i have not completed so i'm like one of those people that buys lunch i'm extremely disciplined like, when it comes to my money like if i have lunch trust and believe i'm gonna buy lunch i mean i'm gonna eat my lunch and i've always been like this i think it's like something that happened throughout like high school primary school i rarely buy takeouts upstairs someone's looking at me guys and i did a bit of work and actually now it's home time i just couldn't film um that section due to the fact that um, i didn't want to film my employees and i told you guys i'm a bit awkward when it comes to vlogging when there's people and i need to let them know unless it's my friends then that's a different story but if not i don't want people on my vlog that shouldn't be on my vlog the lighting is quite pretty here so guys it is the end of the day um it's half past four and i am gonna drive back home i hope there's not too much like sand and traffic but if there is it is what it is i'm actually feeling a bit down um to be honest with you guys um i just i don't know like i'm just feeling a bit down <laughs> i'm just feeling a bit down so yeah, in terms of how my day went, I feel like my day was not as productive as it should have been. Um, there was a lot of work that I didn't get to. I feel like my energy was also like a bit off. Um, like in the morning I was fine, but then... I think, you know, I'm the type of person I like to introspect and figure out why I feel down when I feel down. So I know what's what's like the reason but i think i don't want to share it with you guys but yeah i'm just feeling a bit like eh. but we did majority of what we needed to do and tomorrow's another day it's a new day so i'm gonna come better um my hair is like already just y'all know how natural hair is but we are off to go back home thank you so much for joining me guys uh in this vlog i hope it's long enough 
we don't know but i hope it's long enough but yeah can't emphasize this enough guys health is wealth honey i decided to go to the gym just to relieve a bit of stress and to just increase a bit of my happy hormones as i was feeling a bit down and to be honest with you guys i felt a lot better i feel quite revived quite healthy quite energized guys uh, so now i'm cooling down i'm on the treadmill and i'm going to go take a shower wash my hair um, and then head on to do other things so guys i'm currently in my snooty um i just got back from work and i just want to try um de-stress i'm watching love is blind please guys uh <laughs> i'm sure by the time this video is out i would have been done with the season or not but yeah i'm watching love is blind and just relaxing I knew, I knew that I 